okay so now we have learned how to move our objects and align the objects with the front view side view top view and so many other things now we should get some practice so i'm going to show you a small model over here made out of multiple cubes which requires basically aligning multiple cubes in a shape of rubik cube fine so i want you to do that but to do that you will need to know how to copy objects so we already know copy is control c control v and you can grab immediately the object fine and create a copy of that so if i select this object control c control v grab it on say x axis i have created one copy now another thing that you can do is you can select multiple objects do a control c control v grab it on some axis let us say z and you can recreate a copy of multiple objects so this way you can copy multiple objects and grab and move them together also that is also a possibility now with these basic hints i want you to create something like this okay so this is what i want you to recreate this is the placement of cubes precisely on one top of other fine this is what i want you to recreate there are 27 cubes okay 3339 then 333 three, three inside that and 333 three, three inside that so this is what i want you to recreate and try out this is for first practice that you can have and uh, you should pause your video right now over here and try it out once you have tried it out you will continue after this okay okay so now i am going to show you how exactly you should work with this fine i am assuming that you have already tried on your own so to make the things align perfectly we are not supposed to work directly in the 3d view here so let's first go to the front view of our object and you can see the grid lines so i will make a copy of this control c control v grab on x axis and i will place it one box apart fine roughly we can do very precise placements also that i will take up in some other session but for the time being we'll just use the grid for reference so control c control v grab on x axis and we will place this let's zoom it and grab on x and set it here so now you see three cubes aligned perfectly again come back to the front view now i'll select all three of these fine control c control v grab on z axis now okay and roughly make sure they are separated with that grid again do the control c control v grab so that these three are again copied and let's make sure they are roughly well, so it's not there grab on z axis and place it now again look in the 3d view see so one of the sides is completely ready fine now what is to be done is the remaining two so just like we were copying multiple of them now we will copy all these nine cubes starting from this to this make sure all the nine cubes are there light is getting selected let's unselect the light fine I'll just shift click on the light, it is unselected. Now let us go to a view from which I can see the side. So I go to the side view. Here do a control C, control V, grab on Y axis and place it there. So grab on Y and place it there. Again control C, control V, grab on Y and place it one box apart. Fine grab on y and place it one box apart. so now see our cube is ready so fast with almost perfect alignment why i'm saying almost perfect because i've just used the grid reference and you can see there are a lot of uh, decimal scale for possibility of movement but yes i have set up the required thing 
very easily by using the front view, side view, top view for aligning our objects and copying and moving multiple objects. We will see some other assignments or practice sessions for alignment operations in the next video.